Also getting more information on a deadly accident on the Triangle Expressway that tied up traffic along State Highway 540 throughout the morning. We're told one person was killed and four others were hurt after a work truck smashed through a bridge railing. CBS North Carolina's Lauren Havlin joins us live from that scene. And Lauren, it looks like it's still fairly active down there. Tell us more on what happened. It is still very active and 540 is not quite back open. There are still two lanes on the southbound side that are still closed. I'll just show you how active it still is. We can still see the truck that was involved here at the scene and we've got an environmental crew that is uh, cleaning up spilled fuel where the truck from Greenscape Landscaping landed in the creek below the interstate. Now here's what the scene looked like earlier. Highway Patrol says around 7 o'clock this morning a land Landscaping truck with Greenscape Landscaping with had five people inside. They were headed northbound on 540. Investigators say the driver veered the truck off into the median, hitting the bridge rail. They say the truck was engulfed in flames and continued down into the embankment and into the creek. Highway Patrol says one person is dead and four others in the truck are at local hospitals. While we still don't know where each person was in the car, Highway Patrol says the driver was wearing a seatbelt. The other four were not. Highway Patrol says they believe fatigue played a role in this accident. Now, at this time, we did not know the names of anyone inside that landscaping truck, but we have confirmed through Greenscape Landscaping that it was their employees inside. And when we did speak to the owner earlier this morning, he said as soon as he found out about this accident, everything halted at his company. Live in Wake County, Lauren Havland, CBS North Carolina. Also, this